Now in a Target 12 consumer investigation when a Providence man said his drill exploded while he was using it, we alerted the Consumer Product Safety Commission. And the CPSC launched an immediate investigation. Target 12 consumer investigator Susan Campbell just obtained the agency's report and joins us with what she's learned. Susan? That report says Joe Sorrell suffered minor injuries, including tendonitis and mild hearing loss because of the explosion. The report also references a similar explosion involving the same model drill. It was Wednesday at 10 Joe Sorrell says he was using this drill when it exploded. It's, that thing blew up. It sounded just like a shotgun shell. We first told you about this incident last month. The piece come out, hit my the back window, hit my thumb, and then hit me in the chest. All right, and then I was left with a loud ringing in my right ear. Our Target 12 consumer investigation prompted a Consumer Product Safety Commission investigation into this Chicago electric cordless drill. We obtained a copy of the CPSC's report. It says the battery pack appears to have 14 individual battery cells inside it. It was one of these that was ejected from the bottom of the battery pack and struck the consumer. The report also highlights an online review with a similar consumer complaint about the same model drill. The battery exploded as I was using the drill to clean my barbecue grill. Luckily, no injuries. According to the owner's manual for this model number 68850 Chicago Electric Tool, which was distributed by Harbor Freight, there's a risk of fire if the battery pack and its charger aren't used properly. Joe says he was following the instructions carefully. There's an angel on my shoulder. In addition to its report, the CPSC sent me a letter which said in part, although the commission has investigated the incident, the commission has not necessarily determined the cause of the incident. According to a spokesperson for the CPSC, Harbor Freight did not respond to the agency's notification in this case. It's important to note the company was not required to respond. Harbor Freight did not respond to my questions today about the CPSC's report. The Target 12 investigators are always looking to uncover news. If you want to send a tip or report government waste, call our tip line 228-1763 or email us at target12 at WPRI.com. I'm Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.